Hello, my name is Dr. Hans-Jürgen Clemens and on behalf of Motik I would like to invite you to our video about how to use face contrast on our microscopes BA310 and BA410 and of course the respective elite versions of both models. What is face contrast about? Face contrast is a specialized illumination method to translate the optical thickness or as we say the refractive index of a certain sample into a visible black and white contrast. Face contrast is especially useful in terms of living specimen, thin, unstained sections or smears out of your body, for example. When doing face contrast, the illumination is done through a ring-shaped slot inside the condenser. Please note that our turret condenser, which fits to the BA310 and the 410 models, carries five positions. Phase 1, Phase 2, Phase 3, a bright field position and a respective dark field position. Phase 1, 2 and 3 are abbreviations which are in reference to the ring size of the respective objectives. Please check for the objective in use which illumination ring is necessary to match this respective objective. The ring size is indicated in green letters on the objective sleeve. For example, the 10 times objective carries phase ring number one. So we have to swing in phase ring number one on the turret condenser. The final adjustment of the illumination is done when the turret condenser is mounted onto the microscope instead of the standard condenser. So the standard condenser will be replaced. Additionally, the centering telescope will replace one eyepiece in order to get a perfect alignment of both rings, illumination ring and ring inside of the objective. Now I would like to show to you how to mount the turret condenser onto a BA410. First of all, of course, you have to remove the standard condenser. So please, drive down the condenser carrier from the left side and loosen the fixing screw on the right side. Then you can take off the standard condenser. The turret condenser has got an orientation pin, so it will be very easy to find the right position within the condenser carrier. Once you found it, fix it. And again, drive the condenser carrier upwards. Now you've got the preconditions to make a perfect cooler setup using the bright field position of the turret. Once the cooler setup has been done of perfect bright field illumination, we can switch to phase. In this case, a 20 times phase is in the ray path. 20 times phase with a phase ring size of pH2. So we have to change the turret condenser to the position pH2. The final alignment of the illumination with a phase ring is done with the help of the centering telescope. You have to remove the regular eyepiece and instead you will have to push in the centering telescope. Focusing of the centering telescope is done by loosening the screw, the fixing screw, and pull out the inner part of the centering telescope. Once you found those two rings I was talking about, just fix the screw for firm positioning. The final positioning of the illumination ring inside the turret condenser is done with the help of the centering keys. Those keys have to be inserted on both sides of the turret condenser from the back. Okay. Left side and right side. Looking through the centering telescope, you can now easily move the illumination ring until it comes to complete overlapping with the dark ring of the respective face contrast objective. The alignment of the illumination rings has to be done separately for each objective. So please take out the centering keys first, swing in the next objective and choose the correct illumination ring. Please refocus in order to see both rings clearly. And again, fine adjustment has to be done by the centering keys. 
please note that there is an automatic function built in the turret condenser. Anytime you are choosing a face position, the aperture diaphragm opens automatically. We hope that this video will be useful for you. Anytime you want more information about Motic and the fantastic world of microscopy, you may visit us on our YouTube channel or other social media platforms or just on our Motic website, moticeurope.com. Thanks for your attention. See you soon.